at La Jolla United Methodist Church, we believe that the act of participating in worship, whether we are in person or online, helps us to commune with God and with our faith community, and that doing so transforms us, changes us. God transforms us, changes us. We have the opportunity to respond to the way that this act of worship changes us. And here are just a few ways that you might respond to God's transforming work. We have a large assortment of Lent resources for families on the back counter. We have a devotional book that has stickers, ideas for activities to do Lent at home, and another storybook that's a pop-up picture thing. We also have Lent books that are in baskets according to age level, and please help yourself and enjoy them. A few weeks ago, I asked for your help. If you have any palm fronds that are being trimmed from trees in and around your neighborhood, your house, if you could bring those in for our upcoming Palm Sunday worship, we would sure be grateful. And I'd like to ask for your help again. I know that the tradition in this congregation, which, which is new to me, the tradition of this congregation is on Palm Sunday to have a, a, a children's procession with palms and after that service to have a, an Easter egg hunt for children. Friends with Pastor Derek on medical leave, I need your help. If you have some experience with either of those things, if you feel like you want to step into a new thing, if you feel God's call, God's nudge, God's still small voice calling you to participate in something with children, please let us know in the church office. We need your help with that Palm Sunday procession with children and an Easter egg hunt after that Palm Sunday worship service for children. If you can help in either of those ways or both of those ways, please contact us in the church office. Thank you. Friends, Holy Week is fast approaching, and I wanted to make sure that you know of our upcoming Holy Week schedule. Of course, we expect to have Palm Sunday worship with the waving of palms and, and hopefully with the inclusion of children, as you, as you saw in the earlier worship announcement. And that'll be right here in the sanctuary, of course, at 10 a.m. It'll also be available online. There will be a, a Maundy Thursday service, again, here in the sanctuary and online. And we'll be inviting our good friends from Pacific Beach United Methodist Church to join us, uh, both here and online. And, of course, we'll celebrate Holy Communion. That'll happen on Maundy Thursday at 7 p.m. On Good Friday, also at 7 p.m., will be a, a Good Friday service, both in person and online. And that will be in person at Pacific Beach United Methodist Church, as we are welcomed by their good hospitality. Then on Easter Sunday morning, it starts early, starts early with an Easter sunrise service on Mission Bay, particularly at Crown Point Park. This will be a joint worship service between Pacific Beach United Methodist Church, La Jolla United Methodist Church, and the Water's Edge Faith Community from First Church in Mission Valley. All three congregations uh, with the opportunity to gather together as the sun rises on Mission Bay. Then back here at La Jolla United Methodist Church, we'll have a, a rousing music-filled Easter celebration at 8.30 a.m. in person and 10 a.m. both in person and online. We have a number of opportunities to celebrate all of Holy Week with Palm Sunday, Maundy Thursday, Good Friday, and Easter Sunday. Come and participate and feel yourself filled by these important, vital, and vibrant celebrations. Hello friends, Camp Cedar Glen is back and we would like to invite you to a summer of fun, faith, and fellowship. Registration is open and the early registration discount ends on April 1st. So sign on up, bring a friend, and if you have a passion for young people, we'd love to have you as a counselor. I'll see you all soon. Thank you for taking a moment to consider how you might respond to the way God's transforming work has already begun within you. I believe that you are here for a reason, that God has called you to participate in this faith community, whether you're in person or online. And I hope, I hope that you will respond to the work that God is doing in you.